legacy grants to Catholic Campus Ministry at Northern Michigan University help to fund student peer ministers. These young people are actively evangelizing on campus, bringing students closer to Christ. There's a pasta dish, there's Parmesan cheese to go on that if you'd like it. We have garlic bread, there's bread rolls and butter, and then two different kinds of salads. Um, so as a peer minister for NMU's Catholic Campus Ministry, um, I'm currently in charge of our uh, Wednesday night food for thought meal, uh, actually what we're doing right now. Um, so every Wednesday evening we have uh, what we call food for thought. So we um, have a home cooked meal uh, from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. Uh, the meal is donated by um, parish members from St. Michael's. Um, and then from 7 to 8 we have a faith uh, talk about some topic. Here I'm the peer minister in charge of the Bible study. Um, so I work with Father and we decide what topic we're going to work on, uh, what book we're going to read through. Um, we just recently got done with a, a book by Grant Petrie on uh, the Eucharist. So I've been a peer minister since my sophomore year um, and so I've had freshmen come in every year since then and it's just really cool to see them grow and how they, they just really are hungry for that knowledge. They just really want to learn. And, and they want to know and understand and so they're involved in everything and, and they ask questions and you just get to have really great conversations with them. And, and I got involved with CCM here uh, fall of 2017. My cousin who went to uh, Lake Superior State University, he said, Matt, go try it out, go try it out, it'd be really good. Because there's a time in my life where I kind of lost a lot of faith for about like five years and everything. So then when I came back here, I found a real good home, a real good family life here and everything, and like learned so much more about the Catholic faith than what I have in my whole life of being Catholic and whatnot. So that's a really good experience for me. I'm the communications person here. So I do the social media, like the Facebook, and um, I'm working on the fall newsletter. I'll do the spring one next semester. I love the people. The people, they're so genuine and so kind and they will do anything for you. If you have a bad day, you come here. They'll talk you through it, give you hugs, make sure you're doing okay, make you a cup of tea. Or if um, you're just having a great day, they're here, they'll share your joy with you. And blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and So we really appreciate your support and knowing that there's people out there that support what we do. Um, you know, sometimes being a young Catholic can be hard, um, especially in these times when you know things don't always go our way when it comes to the way the government run thing or runs things or the way the university wants us to think. So um, it's very uh, welcoming and um, heartwarming to know there's people who support us in what we're doing as young Catholics. So thank you.